If you can't keep a promise, never make one. Promises give birth to hopes which at some point in time vanishes in thin air just like that if those promises are not kept. They say that children are the blessings of God and their presence is true bliss. If their funny chit-chatter can make us laugh, then their tears can ache our hearts too. Then just imagine the amount of pain a little heart goes through when you make an empty promise and break them. At some point in time, your child may start developing behaviors like being stubborn and developing a sense of fear. They may even stop opening up to you about how they feel. So to begin with, what is an empty promise? Let me walk you through a small example. Okay, sweet pea, if you stack up all those toys strewn all over the floor into the cupboard, then I'll give you a candy bar. Come on quick, let me see if you can do it. The little one being so naive and innocent does exactly what his or her mom says. It might seem fair when you see it from a parent's perspective because all they expect from their little one is for them to be responsible and independent. But unknowingly, you're just sowing a seed of hope in them and then breaking it apart. Hollow Threats Hollow threats are another factor which parents take up to ensure that their kids behave properly or do an activity in a certain way. You've got to do your homework or else I am not going to let you out to play with your friends. This method can indirectly hurt their emotions. That's a very scary thought. Even in their presence, you might feel that you've lost them. But relax, it's never too late. Here are six best practices that will help shape parenthood for the better. Practice what you preach. Children are shrewd observers. They grasp things instantly. If you want your child to tidy up a room or follow a routine, show them how it's done in a very sweet and polite manner without tying them up to any desires. Add a pinch of fun to such activities and you'll see how your little one gets along. Seek help. Say you're caught up in gardening work and you're completely exhausted. You can call out your little one to give a helping hand. Maybe they can catch some sunshine and experiment something new. It's okay to get those little fingers mucky for a day. In this process, your child will not only learn a new habit of lending help, but also learns a new art. Benefits of performing new tasks If you keep rewarding your kids for each and every activity they perform, they'll tend to ask you for more and that's a big no-no. Anything in excess can spoil your child as he or she may grow up to be a demanding brat. Instead, why not educate your thoughts on the benefits of performing an activity? Let's say hygiene for example. You know how children can get all lazy and irritated when their mothers tell them to take a bath. Maybe this is the right moment where you explain to your kid how important it is to maintain good health and hygiene. Next time you'll see them rush to take a shower even before you call out their names. Be polite and make them aware. Children make a lot of mistakes. Yes, after all, it's a tender phase and an age of exploration. They have no clue what's right and what's wrong. That's when you've got to sit them down and make them understand why it's wrong and the consequences one would have to face. And when I say consequences, that doesn't mean you have to prowl over and yell at them. Parenting a child is certainly a difficult task and it's true that you require ample patience. You need to be polite and sweet with them so that they get convinced and not to repeat their mistakes again. Performing recreational activities Children are known to be very lively and throwing tantrums too. 
but that's absolutely fine. You can always find tricks to make it up to them. What say you play their favorite song and do a funny move in front of them? Make them laugh out loud and let the four walls of your house talk about the tales of laughter. Love and encouragement. Children are pure souls who are mischievous and sensitive at the same time. Love and attention is something they always crave for. So you've got to mellow it down with them. Spend quality time with them. Encourage them in all their achievements and be their guiding light when they have no answers. Parenting children is definitely a long journey where learning doesn't come to an end. It's a trial and error phase. Children teach you patience and it's bonding and communication that makes parenthood beautiful.